Yo guys, what's happening? Today we are on the brand new Forza Horizon 4 with Ashley. Ashley, say hello. Yo, yo. <laughs> uh, today we're going to be doing a couple of challenges on the game. Um, we're going to be doing the closest cars that are closest to our real life cars that we've had in the past now because both me and Ashley have uh, just got rid of our cars. Now he had a 325i with straight pipes that was the straight 6 version 2.5 litre and it was pretty decent wasn't it? Yeah it was nice one. Yeah it's nice. The estate version though. And yeah it was the estate version. Forza have kind of not let us have the E46 anymore and removed it from the game so I can't get as close as so I've yeah. compromised and gone with the E30. Yep, so he's going to go with the E30 M3, because that's closest to his, that's in the game. And I'm going with the RS3 Sportback, as you know, Arya was a A318 Turbo. Now I'm going to buy my car. Ashley's already bought his, but he's just modifying it now. And uh, I'm going to try and see if I can get a livery that's just normal, standard silver. Um, and then I'm going to try and do it like Arya was. <laughs> and we'll see how that goes. I want silver, really. Oh, there's a... What's that? that? Is that silver? Hold on, let's go on normal. My silver was quite a bluey silver, wasn't it? Yeah, it was like a... It was close to like a white... Like an off-white silver. Yeah. If that makes sense. Uh, I think I have it, to be honest. Mine was just black. <laughs> it's like a... I'm just going to go normal silver for the... For the game. So I'm going to go on that. And then I'm going to actually buy the car. And then what we're going to do, guys, is a couple of uh, challenges. So we're going to start off with the drag strip going to see who's is faster and we're going to operate everything to do with the cars and see which one is the best um, because we never actually got a chance to do it in real life to race our cars because before uh, while mine was playing up all the time I get pooed <laughs> don't swear uh, but yeah um, we never got a chance to do it in real life because obviously it's on British roads. Um, it's not quite like Forza Horizon. There is a lot of police cars around Canuck and stuff. Um, and also, when Ashes wor was working, mine wasn't working, and when mine was working, his wasn't. Um, <laughs> mine was good. Mine always worked. <laughs> uh, well, yeah, but you couldn't <laughs> afford the fuel. <laughs> well, but yeah, yeah, so let's go into the garage let's upgrade my car I'm gonna do a custom upgrade and I'm gonna upgrade everything and I'm guessing that you're doing the same in your ash yeah I've done the same I've just gone for an engine swap though are you oh you've liter, engine swap have you yeah I've took the standard 2 litre engine out and put the 2.6 straight 6 have you Ooh. Yeah. I'm gonna stick with my 2.5 so litre turbo um, but yours wasn't a 2.5 litre turbo, was it then? No, mine was a 1.8 turbo, but this is a 2.5 exactly. turbo. So this <laughs> is 2.5 turbo, guys, running 400 brake, all-wheel drive. I think it's 400 brake, isn't it? It's normal, it normally are. In real life, yeah, they're 400 brake. Like 350. Three, is it? On this standard model, well, or is it the there, brand new one that's 400? It's a brand new one that's 400. Is it? All right, fair enough. Right, so we're going to go from the stock intake. We're not going to have a panel filter like this one. We're going to go straight for the cone, but we're going to get forced induction into the cone filter to get the best cooling. We're going to put the race fuel system on. Uh, it's just going to feed more fuel into the engine. It says that it's 18 brake, but in real life it doesn't really work like that. The ignition, we're going to get better ignition race ignition you don't really get much horsepower out of that re in, really in real life or exhaust 
with 19 brake horsepower for race exhaust. On the camshafts, these do make a, a big difference. Race cams and valves, we're going to have the racing ones put in, 75 horsepower, and loads better valves. Now, if you if you look from the street valves and the race valves, there isn't much difference, but obviously we're going all out here. Um, we've got to be on top performance, and seeing as Ash's engine swapped his car, um, to have a loads bigger engine than it did have, then I'm going to have to get something really big to do this. And I might... There's only a 0.5 litre difference. Yeah, but it's a big difference, though, in brake horsepower sometimes, you know. Yeah, so that is changing my speed to 7.8. Okay. So I'm going to do that, a race turbo. I might twin turbo it after. We've got to be get a better racing intercooler, front mount intercooler, to put on the front. And we're going to do the race oil cooling, which is 9 horsepower gain. Got to put a light racing flywheel, which would be a dual mass in real life. Uh, obviously, whenever you're modifying a car, guys, you really do have to put better brakes on. Ashley, you n knew this uh, in real life, didn't you? <laughs> Maybe. Because <laughs> your brakes were a bit wank. <laughs> Mine were really good. <laughs> My brake didn't even work. <laughs> <laughs> it's a BMW, mate, that's, that's why. Yeah. So we're going to put better stiff anti-roll bars in. <clears throat> and obviously, we have to make it look like oh yeah, so it's got to be slammed to the floor. And yours was lowered as well, wasn't it, Ash? Yeah, I'm not gonna put a roll cage in because it adds weight, and in the game you re you don't really need it. Neither of our cars had um, roll cages in them in real life, anyway. Uh, then standard weight reduction. I think neither of us had the weight reduction, did we, in real life? No. <coughs> no. Um, gonna have a racing clutch. Shift time is 0.04 second. Every 0.0 second counts in this race against Ashley. <laughs> <coughs> Shift time in the transmission. And then we're going to put the drive line in. We're going to have the racing one because it's 12.6 kilo lighter. We're going to have a racing differential. This will be a limited slip disc. Uh would think yeah limited slip diff so fuck's sake limited slip diff right we're gonna have a little bit of a spoiler on it because it's Sorry got a lot of I'm sick. currently at the drag strip waiting and it's got an active starting starting light yeah I know yeah sick in it That's shall I put a spoiler really on it really good interpretation it takes it takes loads off my thing, so I'm not going to do that because I didn't have a bigger spoiler on my car. And the standard uh, rear Valance or Valance or whatever it's called is the best for this car. Now, I think the Audi ones on this aren't as good as these ones, so I'm going to do less drag, minus 1% on the drag factor on that. Let's have a look at the conversions. Uh, I'm not doing an engine swap because the engine swap would be mad um, on this car. It's not really much point now. I wouldn't do a real wheel drive drivetrain. Although in real life you wouldn't really want that because this is four wheel drive. So I'll have the initial launch on Ash unless he's converted his car to uh, front wheel drive. Uh, Four wheel drive because his is drive. standard rear wheel drive. Yours is four wheel drive, yeah? It's uh, standard rear wheel. I know it's standard rear wheel. I mean, like when. No, now you've got it. Is, is it four wheel drive? Rear wheel drive. Rear -wheel drive. Okay. No. So I should have the initial jump on you. You reckon? Who do you reckon's going to win, be. guys? Consider it. Now I'm going to just. How do you go on just to get a new livery so I can put like a sticker on it or something? Designs and paints. Where's that? Go back. 
Off the... Oh. Is it? Oh yeah, I'll say it, I'll say it. Yeah. Apply livery, okay. Oh, no, 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 no. And I'm going to just get... I just want to apply a vinyl and decal. Okay, so a vinyl, a vinyl shape. I don't want that really. I mean, I want it on the. Oh, it's not going to let me do it on the actual window where my no. thing was. So let's manufacture a decal. Uh, I didn't have a K and N air filter on mine. I had a <coughs> what did I have? A Forge Motorsport one on my Audi, and I had D back boxed. I didn't really say much about my Audi. I only did that uh, thingy video, didn't I? I'm just going to keep it standard like that, and then I'm going to go meet Ash on the drag strip outside. So we're going to do a drag strip challenge and then we're going to do a race see which one's fast around a circuit oh my god this sounds amazing <laughs> oh that is a beautiful engine the 2.5 litre uh, five cylinder guys not six cylinder so it's a five cylinder versus the six cylinder that Ash has got I'm just gonna try and find the drag strip somewhere wherever Ashley is down here somewhere I think it's over here. Is it over here? Dibba 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 dibba. It is. There it is. Oh no, no, that's not it. That's not it. Is this it? Yes, there it is. Where are you, Ash? And you're are you on the drag strip? Yeah, yeah, um, yeah. So this is the drag strip, guys. And up the top is the lights. And in this game, it has actually done the drag strip like a normal drag strip. And you can see my beautiful. Audi down here. Have a look at this beautiful car. Now it looks white in this light. It's supposed to be silver, but can't really do much about that. But this is the closest that you're going to get. See the aid MCJ on the back. Very, very nice. The car does look very, very nice. And my my Audi was um, slammed like this. It wasn't as slammed as this because this would be like air ride slammed but it does look very nice and we're just waiting for Ash to come into the party and get to the drag strip and then when he's here we shall have some drone footage of both of them and then we will go here he comes guys here we can see his car the E30 M3 oh, oh that looks tidy oh, <laughs> a little bit of a uh, Screwed up drift there, mate. <laughs> Screwed up drift? I meant to do that, what you want I'm not the best with this drone. Okay, meet me on the start line. Well, actually, we'll have a look at your car first. Now, what have you done to it? I see you've got new alloys on it. Yeah. It looks like you've well, done the German thing that I did on... Name on my Audi where the indicators are on constantly for some reason you've got a front yeah. splitter that you've changed have you got the rocket bunny kit on it? yes I do oh very nice look at that look at that guys that's Reason really really is, nice I like the wide arches I really like the yeah. wide arches on the rocket bunny kits doesn't matter yeah. what car it's on it always wide arch really body nice. kits look sick on all cars to be honest very very nice so you kept the you swapped the engine didn't you yes it's got the 2.6 straight six okay and what brake horsepower is it producing race. it's sitting at 700 brake at the minute okay I'm not actually sure what mine's sitting at right now but I've done a you know, couple of tweaks on the tuning as well have you I haven't done anything yeah. to the tuning because I don't really know what to do on the tuning. So I'm gonna get out of the drone guys. Actually I wanna take a photo of both of the cars lined up. Really. I, I don't know how to do it. 
Whereabouts are you? Uh, right in front of your car and you're inside my car. <laughs> Get out of my car. <laughs> Go right next to me. Okay, how, how do I take a screenshot, like, for the... Come out of drone mode. Oh, hold on. I think... Can I do a... Or you just press the home button and square. Or, no, Y, sorry. Oh, and go back in. What? The home button and Y? Y, yeah. What, hold it? It didn't work. No, just press the home button and then tap Y. Oh, it doesn't matter. I'm out, and I'm out of the thing now, anyway. Right. Line up on the start line. As close as you okay, can get to it. Right. I'm I'm pretty much or is as it close as I can one? get. Fuck Let's go on either. Okay, guys, there's Horrible someone else thing. trying to get in on our in a Viper. little thing. A, horrible, a Viper. Horrible looking Viper. That is not okay, we go. nice. Okay. So we're going to go now, guys. When it hits green, see who's fastest. Here we go. Oh, the Viper has beaten us. I've got the initial launch on Ashley. Oh my god, this this five-cylinder engine it sounds beautiful. So, on the first one, Ashley, I have won the drag race. <laughs> How do you feel? <laughs> Shall we well, do a best of three? Is always gonna be there, really. <laughs> yeah, everyone. Let's do a best of three. So we'll race back to the... See, you pretty much keeping up then. Maybe you should have done a four-wheel drive conversion, mate. I can go and do that if you want me to. We can try it after this, if you want. Yeah, yeah. Oh, shizer. Let's see what the actual difference is then. Yeah, I reckon that it'll be very, very close then. So sitting, I'm sitting on the line again, waiting for Ashley to rejoin. Are you as? Have you got a chatter? On your turbo? The what? Have you got a chatter turbo on your car? Yeah, you have. Just like mine. On my Audi. Mine doesn't do it on the RS3, but it did it on my actual car in real life. Okay, you're... Yeah. Let's do it on the next set of lights. Yeah. That bloody V8 sounds crap in that bloody Viper. I'm guessing it's a ACR SR10 or something. Stupid. I don't. I hate bikes. Yeah, I don't Every like them either. Ever come out, they all look the same, and they just look. <laughs> okay, <clears throat> let's get ready, guys. Here we go. I'm going to try the launch control. Here we go. Oh! Oh! I've got a slow launch off the front. Ashley is behind again. <laughs> and if I win this, then that is the best out of three. Oh, got to slow down. Okay, so I won the second one. Ashley, do you want one more, or well, shall we go straight to the uh, well, I can go circuit? The, the four-wheel drive is the difference. Shall we see what it is like with four-wheel drive? Because I don't yes. think you're going to be able to launch as well as me. With your car being like that. Okay, so we're going to come back when he's fixed his car into a four-wheel drive, guys. Uh, doing well, what BMW don't like doing. <laughs> and put in... He's staying in a straight line. X-Drive kit on. <laughs> Basically, he's putting an X-Drive kit on. And I reckon the Audi Quattro is so much better four-wheel drive system than the X drive but we shall see in a minute when he's bought it back right oh. Ashley has joined us once again guys and now it's going to be a real battle of Quattro versus BMW X drive which is the four wheel drive system so we're going to go on the lights Ashley are you ready best out of yeah. three 
Oh, it's intense now, guys. I know that I haven't got a massive... Oh, my God, he's taking me, guys. He's absolutely smashing me. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Look at how that car <laughs> takes off. Oh, my God. This must be the Alpine version you must have. <laughs> right, best out of three. And I think... I don't really stand a chance now. That is amazing how that takes off compared to mine now. I was absolutely rinsing you before. Jesus. That is quick. I I thought Quattro was better. Maybe maybe your M3's got a load more horsepower than mine now. <laughs> I think mine's got 653 or something. So yours has probably got a little bit more. Alright, let me just come back a bit. Oh, for God's sake. Go back, please. There you go. So on the next lights, we're going to go for the second time. And if Ashley does win again, then we go straight to the circuit race and see which handles better round a circuit instead of a straight line. Oh, it's so tense. So tense. I really want to jump the lights. Oh, God, I've got him. Oh, no. No, he's fucking beating me on, no! Oh, absolute trounced me. Try not to hit his car with my expensive car. <laughs> absolutely trounced me. This old school BMW with its newfound four-wheel drive system is absolutely rinsing me. Oh, best drifts. I wonder what which one does the best drifts. Yours would have been better in the... Rear wheel drive, <clears throat> drive a train, but we'll see. Right, so we're going to go to the next challenge now, guys, which is a circuit race. So I've created a new event, guys, a German event, and we've got some performance cars with us, some VW GRC Beetles, <laughs> Porsches, <laughs> and then there's... <laughs> Me and the Audi RS3 and Ashley in his very, very nice BMW M3. Now, this is going to once and for all say which car is the best. And I'm guessing Ash is probably going to have a little bit... He's got a little bit more brake horsepower on me. Um, but it doesn't necessarily say mean that he's going to be better in the corners. You know, Audi Quattro systems have always been better on rallies and stuff, but we can't really take Ash's BMW into a rally because neither of our cars are really built for rally. They are more for straight line speed and stuff. I'm, I'm looking by how it is right now, looks like Ash might win, but you never know because I think it's BMW is a little bit lacking of luster in the corners lacking of luster I don't know Even what that means just, like, I'm just you know don't know what I don't know what I just said guys but you know I'll, I'll have that printed on a t-shirt <laughs> for all of you to see lacking of luster exactly the Germans Oh, that will be put I on am. a t-shirt and that will be sold. The Germans. <laughs> yes. Hell yes. Oh, I am really struggling now, guys. I'm doing very, very bad <laughs> at the moment. Now also, guys, while you're watching this, um, I will be doing no, no. some other videos no. on Forza Horizon 3 with Ashley and a couple of other friends and stuff. Oh, I have lost, guys. I've come last. How is that? Oh. <laughs> I'll come 11th, mate. Don't worry about it. <laughs> oh, my God. We, we got absolutely trounced, guys. But as you can see from the leaderboard, Ash's car won. So, you know, my fiance is going to be very, very happy with this result. Uh, because the Audi was second, but... Both cars look absolutely stunning, don't they, Ash? Yes, definitely. I think we need to go and find a little uh, 
secret spot and get some photos. Yeah, so we're going to go do that now. But thank you so much for watching, guys, and thank you to Ashley for doing the video with me and producing I this beautiful car that he has. Uh, the M3 was how much did it cost you to buy and build, mate? I think it was fully built. I think it was just over 100k. Yeah, that's about the sim. I think mine came up to about 90k. So we, yeah. yours was slightly more expensive, but it's been an absolute pleasure. And we're gonna go take some photos now, guys. That's what we always do. Uh, when we've got some nice ass cars. So thank you very much for watching. Okay. And we'll see you next time.